Hey, what's going on, guys? Today I'm going to be talking about where Call of Duty Black Ops 2 is today and what it's like. But first, press the subscribe button and give this video a like for more videos like this one. Call of Duty Black Ops 2 was released on November 13th, 2012, almost seven years ago. Call of Duty Black Ops 2 was ranked 5th best according to the Top10.com after Call of Duty World at War, Black Ops, Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare, and in the number 1 spot, Modern Warfare 2. I myself don't agree with these rankings. My top 5 list would be Modern Warfare 2 at number 1, Call of Duty Black Ops 2 at number 2, World at War at number 3, Black Ops at number 4, and at 5 would have to be World War 2. My list was mostly based off of what games I had first, like Modern Warfare 2 was my first Call of Duty, and Black Ops 2 was my second, which was very popular in my past years. But for Black Ops 2 to be 7 years old, I am very surprised about how many people still play it. I mean, yes, it was a good game, but there were still like 40 team deathmatch lobbies and 8 free-for-all lobbies, which I thought was pretty good. But throughout those 6 lobbies I played in today, there weren't that many modders that ruined the game for me. Uh, this really surprised me because the last time I played, which was back in July of last year, there were so many hackers in the lobbies. Like, every lobby I was in had at least one hacker, and that's the reason I stopped playing Black Ops 2, was because of the hacking. But now that I saw that there was less hacking throughout the game, I might start playing it more and might make more videos on it. From then to now, I just let my Call of Duty skill went down. There's no doubt that I was at least 10 times better back in July of last year than I am now. As you see in this footage here, back in July, I was still good at the game. Here you see me now. Um, the things I noticed that when I was playing, I don't check my minimap as much as I used to. Like back in July, I used to check my minimap so often, I knew where every player was in the, in the map, and now I just don't as much. And also, my eyes were more focused on the surrounding area more than anywhere else. Like, I wasn't really looking straight ahead. My aim was very off because of this. But overall, Black Ops 2 is an amazing game. It really brought back memories when I used to play on my Xbox 360 every night after school with my friends. If I had to rank Black Ops 2 on a scale of 1 to 10, I would give it a good 9 out of 10. Definitely, it would have to be in my top 3 Call of Duty's of all time, too. So thank you all for watching, please subscribe and if you want more videos like this give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment on what you would like to see in upcoming videos and I'll see you guys in the next video.